Well, hello and welcome. Welcome to the island of Brach in Croatia. Milno, to be precise. David here for Royal Navy Yachtmaster. Thanks for joining us here on our summer deployment. You're going to have some great educational content. So sit back, relax, and enjoy today's video. All right, let's get dirty. Today's segment is how to use a boat toilet in a hygienic and considerate way, considerate to your other uh, crew members, other people on the boat with you. I'm echoing, I'm in the toilet. All right, let's talk about this. Let's get real sort of granular, okay? Over the years, I've been on boats where other guests have not been properly taught how to use a boat toilet, because a boat toilet is not like your toilet at home. And I'm gonna show you how it works. And other guests use the toilet and you're left with the inevitable puddles of urine in the bottom of the toilet, or you're left with a toilet that's full of waste and it's slopping around. And it's really quite, can become quite unpleasant quite quickly. So today we're gonna show you an actual toilet flush and simulate a toilet flush so that you know how to do it in a manner that is, as I said, hygienic, safe, and considerate to your other people on the boat and just for yourself as well. So the key component parts of the toilet are the pump that pumps up and down. You'll notice these locking symbols here. In all the years I've been using boat toilets, I don't know what they do and it doesn't matter. But over here, this is pretty obvious, that fills with water and that empties. Look, it's a lever filled with water and empty. Now, a boat toilet in its natural state does not have water in it. A boat toilet pumps whatever is in the toilet, waste, etc., through the pump, through these pipes that swirl around back here and eventually, through a few loops, find their way out into the ocean, frankly, or into the holding tank on the boat. And so what they need is liquid to make it all work, okay? Because if there's no liquid, it's like trying to pump a, a, a brick through a pipe and it's just not gonna happen. So here's our toilet waste. There it is. Now, I wanna emphasize it's bread and coffee, in case you're curious. So, you need water in the bowl before you um, actually go to the bathroom. So you're gonna fill the bowl with water, like that. You're gonna go to the bathroom, and then you're gonna start to pump it dry. There you go, all the waste is gone. But you are not gonna leave the toilet like that, with urine and feces in the bottom, and feces and urine all around the toilet. What you're gonna do as a considerate boat guest or crew member is flip to seawater in. It's gonna pump clean seawater in. And by the way, it takes a little minute to pump all that waste through the pump, through the pipes and out over the side. So you want water to pump it through. So look, now we have nice clean seawater. Let's pump that dry. There's a little bit more waste appeared, so let's repeat the process. Okay, nice and clean. And then if we're out at sea and the boat's gonna be moving and sloshing around, let's pump it dry again. Nice and clean. And then the next person who comes in to use the toilet, before they go to the toilet, what do they need? Water, water. You're gonna pump some water in. Then you're gonna to go to the toilet and do it all again. Wow, that was quite a workout. Whew. So as I said, the toilet on a boat is not like your toilet at home. I think there's an opportunity for the boat toilet manufacturers to stop telling us what they've been telling us for the last 30 years that I've been in boats, which is don't put paper down the toilet. Ooh. Uh, if you, you, Of course you can put paper down the toilet, but do multiple flush cycles so you don't block it because blocking a boat toilet is a nightmare. Ladies, don't put any feminine products down it because that's kind of 
guaranteed uh, failure. So, all right, I hope that was helpful. Enjoy your vacation. Don't block the toilet. Well, thanks for watching. And remember, you can find me at royalnavyyachtmaster.com. You can hire me to come out on your boat. I'll stand shoulder to shoulder with you, coach you so that you'll be more confident, safe, so you'll go out and have fun on your boat. Thanks for watching.